So, uh, so I'm gonna get started here. Let me have my cheating tool ready. Um, and I'm gonna just uh, start a new thread because perplexity started going a little bit goofy <laughs> when a thread gets too long. So I, I just want to start a new thread. Um, and um, so for the first half of this demo, which I think uh, based on my past experience will take about five minutes, I'm basically gonna turn off my brain as far as physics content goes. I'm just gonna copy and paste and just to get the answers. And after I've done that, and if there's time, wait, am I in Copilot? Zero left today. What? No, no, yeah, yeah, I'm logged in, so. Okay, uh, let me actually do a new thread, because, uh, uh, yeah, I, I, um, okay. I think I must just waste like 30 seconds here. Um, so the 10 minute time limit, it's a set up um, intending to prevent the check cheaters like two years ago, <laughs> um, maybe three years ago. And with the generative AI, I do recognize that it doesn't work. It, the 10 minutes is plenty of time to do what I'm doing, which again, I can't emphasize enough that it is cheating, don't do it. During the timed assessment, you're not supposed to have outside help. What it could be useful for, it is actually, it can be useful learning tool in this sense. So with multiple choice, you get three tries. And my advice always is, you know, after the first try, unless you got 10 out of 10, take some break, it takes some time to study. And one of the studying you could be doing is you can review your work and try to figure out which questions you got wrong. And as you figure out, why is that so long? Uh, as you figure out which questions you got wrong, um, um, so that would be a way to study. And if uh, if you're having difficulty figuring out with uh, even with the additional time which questions you got wrong, then maybe generative AI can, AI can help you do that. That's one way I can see this actually being used in an ethical way, uh, kind of studying after you've taken it. But while you are taking it, you should not be having something like this. This um, I'm doing it as a demo. Uh, demo of what? I'm not sure. <laughs> but you should not be doing what I'm doing. So depending on how much time remains at the end of this, uh, I'll try to correct some of the things that perplexity gets wrong. Uh, so far, what I've seen, it gets about 80% of the questions right. Um, I guess it'll depend on the set. Um, and uh, so I'm on question five. Um, so um, yeah, so if uh, it performs similarly to its a historical performance, it'll probably miss uh, two questions or so. And if I can find them, and if I have time, I'll try to correct it. If I don't, because if I'm in test student mode, I can actually go into the work and kind of have additional time to look at it. <laughs> I don't have to do it within 10 minutes. Uh, with some of the physics 4A content, I've been able to, but with the physics 4B and 4C, what I will say is that, uh, you know, the like uh, the basic lower division mechanics stuff, I can do that in my sleep. I don't need to do any review, I can, um, it's the kind of thing that once you have enough experience, it comes just uh, naturally. But, you know, uh, the classical physics and the modern physics content in physics 4B and 4C, sometimes I forget stuff. I need to look things up. Sometimes I make mistakes if I haven't thought about it in a while. So, um, so you know, don't be too surprised if that happens uh, during sometime during this semester. Because uh, unlike with the physics 4A, I won't have everything perfectly memorized. Uh, okay. And you know, if I uh, am ever teaching upper division, I would uh, have to do a substantial prep work before each class. Uh, okay. It should be something about um, what you or desire the outcome is. At the moment, I'm not really reading. I've turned off my physics brain. I'm just uh, copying and pasting, cheating my way through. Yeah, it's got five choices. Wonder, would that understand this really good uh, <laughs> way of listing the answers? Maybe. 
Oh, uh, uh, I'm gonna have to type in some things manually. The mathematical expressions don't copy well. So thermal reservoirs temperature is TL and TH and TL is less than TH. Uh, how does the efficiency of reversible energy E ref compare with efficient E, e, e ref? Uh, and A is E ref is greater than E, e ref. B is E ref is equal to E, e ref. And see, um, I'm not sure why this is. Ooh, ah, there should have been reversible is less. Okay, I don't think that's the choice anyway. Oh, so I, I think we are fine. Yeah, <laughs> I missed the last one, but I think it's fine. Okay, so let me see how much time I have. I have four minutes and twenty seconds. Um, uh, let's see which ones the Ch GPT got correct. So question one: proper given mechanism of heat transfer, convection material. Yeah, most so that's probably correct. Um, question two, by the list, yeah, water. Uh, you, don't, you don't even need the numbers. <laughs> um, uh, pressure on its surrounding wall. Moment, yeah. Well, it's a, the, there's a reaction force on the wall. Uh, ideal gas law. The pressure on the sample gets increases. Uh, you actually um, a constant temperature pressure increases. So the yeah volume decreases. Okay, that's correct. Um, yeah. Okay, adiabatic expansion, positive work on the surrounding, work comes from yeah that's correct. So far so good. Uh, come on, decrease, decrease because it does work and yeah, yeah I think that's right. So six is so far. Yeah, the, the these two questions are basically mirror versions of each other. Um, for some reason, uh, incorrectly heat transfer with work done. Okay, transfer to raises temperature. Yeah, yeah, this is incorrect. Uh, depending on how these are arranged, you know, the first law of thermodynamics, the internal energy can change due to either of them. So seven, is it gonna get 100% for once? Let me see, uh, okay, three minutes. So we are looking at uh, eight. Uh, heat pump uses the input work to put heat in the high temperature reservoir. Yeah, yeah, that's correct. Well, eight. Current noise. It's the starting from the highest temperature and pressure. Okay. Isothermal expansion, adiabatic expansion. Isothermal. Yeah, I think that's right. Um, wow, it's first time it's getting hundred uh, percent. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, that would be something. So unless I missed something, I think, uh, let me just check the question 10 again real quick. Cardinal heat engine, right, irreversible between the same thermal reservoirs. How does the efficiency, ah, uh, let's see. Yeah, I, I do think this is right. Uh, there's a lecture video on the source of irreversibility and the, so the um, here the reason irreversible one would have less efficiency is the, the temperature of the engine itself would be not quite up to these temperatures if the reservoir temperatures are the same. So yeah, yeah I think it's gonna get 100%. Uh, let me submit it end and let's see if both the GPT-4 and I missed something and <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, wow, um, that is a first. And uh, so this is where I'm saying, uh, it might be a useful uh, learning tool. So let's say you went through the multiple choice time assessment, honestly, without using outside help. And you got, you know, let's say 60%, which is actually pretty decent. It's not all that bad, but you know, my advice that you study, you try to figure out what you got wrong before you use your next attempt. So if you go to review work, you can then now, you know, look at the question, you know, paste it into the GPT or either perplexity or chat GPT and um, see, see its response. See if uh, that helps you figure out which ones you got wrong. And if it does, and it helps you understand better and uh, your next attempt you do better as a result of that, that's great. That I don't think I have any issue with, the, with anything there because while you are taking the assessment, you are using any outside tool. 
So there is no academic dishonesty there. The dishonesty only happens if you have this, you know, open while you are, uh, while you are submitting the 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 timed assessment to where outside help is explicitly uh, prohibited.